Yes, that's a local. What do you think you're playing at? I haven't said anything. You nearly told me. I was winding you up. Sharon has just cremated her son. And I'm not going to tell Sharon. Not in the state she's in. I am going to need a drink, though. I mean, somewhere I can get my own. Away from here. Keys. Don't chill too much, though, yeah? Just don't even touch the sides. You don't even know what you want. I know that that little boy didn't deserve that. He deserves justice. And he'll get it. I just wanted to come over and say, I'm um, sorry, yes. So emotional for your stepmother, ex-stepmother. How was the funeral? Was it beautiful? Oh, I just need to... You just need to speak a bit clearer. Callum. But it's just a little bit uh, hard of hearing. Deaf? So should... Are you deaf? My grandmother was deaf when she wanted to be. I'm gonna... Just tell your friend I was just saying how sorry I am. You can tell him yourself if you want. you just got to speak quite clear. Our condolences. Your family are in our prayers. People are talking a bit fast. I don't then. need your help. No, no, I know, but I'm just Am saying... I not allowed to just be sad for Dennis? Well, Ben, I'm sorry. I'm not I... just the, the poor disabled bloke, you know. <sighs> Big man, you're going to save me again, are you, Callum? Get over yourself. Hey. Look, I know what you're going to say, Jack, all right? But he's grieving. Yeah, and you've got a career. All right, I'm just thinking of you. I remember when Lucy died. Look, I, I wanted a shout till the house fell down. I really thought... just one day... No one blames you, OK? It's not your fault. I know the reason Dan is dead. It's Phil. Thank you.